Welcome to my channel. I hope that you enjoyed today's video and if you do don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and if this is your first time here I hope that you'll subscribe and stick around for a while. So I have spiralized three medium zucchini and they give you a lot of zucchini noodles and I love these in place of pasta. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dehydrate them in single serving little bundles and they will shrink down and I will be able to store them in a mason jar and when I get ready for them all I have to do is pour boiling water over it, let it sit for about 10 minutes and they come right back to life. So I use the Excalibur Easy Dry. It's five tray. It blows from the bottom. I've lined mine with my mesh sheets and I am going to just bundle these up on each of these trays in serving size portions and this is about a serving for me. If I want more I can always pull out more than one. So. I'm going to show you how I load these up. Now these are going to dehydrate about 130 degrees, 125 to 135. I always start a little high for the first hour or so and then turn mine down. So I will start these at about 135 and then I will turn them down after about an hour to 125. And I just bundle them up in little bundles and put them on my dehydrator tray. So I'm going to get these all loaded up and I will bring you back. Okay, so I ended up with 11 bundles of zucchini noodles. So that's 11 meals for me because this is typically about what I put in a serving. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put them on the dehydrator and in about four hours I will rotate trays and in about four hours after that I will rotate trays again and check them. These run vegetables are 125 to 135. I usually set mine about 130 and zucchini I have found most days takes 10 to 12 hours. It's raining today so these may take a little bit longer. The humidity is a little bit high today but I will start checking them for doneness around the 10 hour mark. So once these are all dehydrated I will bring you back and we'll rehydrate a bundle of them so I can show you how they look. Alright, my zucchini has finished drying. This actually took almost 15 hours. But again, it was raining here, so there was high humidity. Now, it is dry. It is cracking, brittle, dry. So I am going to store it in a jar. And for the next two or three days, every time I walk past, I'll just kind of keep an eye on it and condition it is what it's referred to. Just keep an eye on the jar and make sure that there's no moisture appearing anywhere on it. And I'm actually going to rehydrate this bundle. I am having shrimp and noodles for dinner tonight. So I've got some boiling water and I am just going to cover it in boiling water. And this rehydrates really quickly. It takes about 10 or 15 minutes to come back. These dehydrated down to, they're crispy. And now, anytime that I want zucchini noodles for dinner, all I have to do is grab a little bundle out of my jar. And drop them in boiling water for 10 or 15 minutes and I have zucchini noodles. And I need another jar. So I'll finish putting all of this away and we'll finish rehydrating the zucchini and I will bring you back. And it's been about 10 or 12 minutes and this is what I ended up with. This is eight nests of zoodles. 
All I have to do is open the jar, take one out, drop it in hot water for about 15 minutes, and it's good to go. Now, I will leave these sitting out where I can see them, and for the next several days, I will check the jar daily and look for any moisture building up inside. If I see any, then I will put them back into the dehydrator. And it looks like this has completely reconstituted. Yeah, nice pliable noodles. Tastes like zucchini. And it's been 12 minutes. So 12 minutes is what it took to rehydrate that little bitty nest into a bowl of zucchini noodles. I hope that you enjoyed the video today, and if you do, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, I hope that you will and that you'll stick around. If you hit the bell, they'll notify you when I upload new videos. Thank you so much for watching today. You have a great day.